Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So, throughout the course of last year, progressing towards the end of 2024, Microsoft was starting to push Outlook users onto the new Outlook app. And I found the new Outlook is an app you either like or you don't. And it has been met with quite a lot of negative feedback, as we have been talking about on the channel. And as I've posted previously, Microsoft won't be deprecating the classic Outlook for Windows until 2029. And I'll leave that video linked down below and in the end screen. And because classic Outlook won't be deprecated, Microsoft was giving users the option to go back to classic Outlook. And Microsoft had placed this toggle go to classic Outlook in the new Outlook app. And I apologize for the um, image quality of this image. So go to classic Outlook was available for you to obviously download and go to a website and download the classic Outlook if you'd like to go back. Now, just to let you know that Microsoft over on their support website has once again um, let us know about an issue where they've said that some users have reported that the go back to classic Outlook button in the new Outlook for Windows does not open a support article on how to download classic Outlook for Windows. And the article they are referring to is this support article, which by the way, I'll leave linked down below and in the end screen. And Microsoft has said that the Outlook team is investigating this issue. But if you are experiencing the problem where clicking on that button basically does nothing, then you can come to this article, which as mentioned will be linked and you can click on download or you can install from the Microsoft store. That's how you can get your hands on the classic Outlook if you want to roll back and obviously clicking on that button is doing nothing. So just putting it out there because this is a issue over on their support website. And um, if you are affected, that is the resolution for now. And obviously if I get any more info that this problem has been fixed where the button once again is taking you directly to the, uh, the support article to download Classic Outlook if you want to roll back, so to speak. And obviously, I'll post and let you guys know. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.